so I'm gonna start off with my big board with all these pictures on it. I call this my real life Pinterest board and I absolutely love it. It gives me so much inspiration and I got all these pictures either off Pinterest or Tumblr um, and I just printed them all out and then put it on this wonderful big board. Okay guys, so to the left of my board I have these two pictures. They're both from Hobby Lobby. Both were really cheap but super cute. Okay, now moving on to this back wall I have, this is mainly like my friends area. So over here is my, kind of my storage section for papers and such. So these are the two pieces of storage she got me. This one just has um, rose gold folders that I organize my papers in and then this one has um, a bunch of folders as well and then it has this cute little notepad that I write my to do's on and then it has a book that I wrote that needs a lot of work and who knows if I'll ever finish that <laughs> um, and then also my planner that I keep all my life organized in. By the way guys, this is a DIY planner. If you wanna see like a walkthrough or something, just comment down below and I can do that for you guys. So moving on to this corner of my desk, I just have a really cute rose gold pencil holder. And then I have a rose gold stapler. And then I have this little calendar in the corner that says, when dreams come true at last, there is life and joy, Proverbs 13, 12. I keep it on January 7th every day because I really like that Bible verse. And then right here I have a flower vase and this was a DIY flower vase. It's just like a coffee cup and I put tape around it. Super easy, it took me like minutes to make. And then I just have my laptop right over there, my Bible journaling pens, and then more of my artsy pencils and pens that I use for my art stuff. Okay guys, so moving on over here I have this beautiful picture of a Native American little girl. Native Americans just hold such a special place in my heart because I went there on missions trips and my grandpa had a business there. And then over here is my kind of my little makeup area. I just have my makeup storage, my makeup brushes, and then I also have a Scentsy, which is a candle with a light bulb light, so you don't have to use a fire and it actually smells amazing and then I don't have to worry about burning the house down. And then up here is a lamp from PB Teen. Um, I just love how it's blue and it matches the rest of my room. Okay, so now to get into these desk drawers. Um, they were from Ikea along with this whole desk. So desk drawer one just has pencils, pens, highlighters, sticky notes, tape, um, and the organizer was from Ikea as well. So desk drawer two is pretty much my paper drawer. Drawer number three just has scrapbooking stuff, cutters, um, pictures that I still need to scrapbook, stickers. So this drawer has old journals that I have kept, which I suggest to you guys keep all your old journals so you can look back. Um, so yeah, old journals and then memories from missions trips and stuff like that. So here on the other side of my desk is my makeup drawer and this just has all my eye makeup palettes and extra makeup that I use. This is what I call my Bible study drawer and it has my prayer journal, my Bible, my notebooks, my Jesus always, and then my iPad which has studies on it. And then these last two drawers just hold my art stuff. So this is my pastels, my colored pencils, my markers, and my coloring books and my drawing stuff. And then the very last drawer is all my paint stuff, my watercolors, my acrylics, and all that jazz. Mm -hmm. 